Hey friend, you, you are back with the Aries Alchemist for another general tarot reading and this is for my Scorpios. So if you're a Scorpio, sun, moon, or rising, something in here is for you. First you have the Ace of Wands in reverse, the Queen of Cups in reverse, the Seven of Wands, and the Six of Pentacles in reverse. I'll clarify those and then we'll get into what it means. Ace of Wands in reverse, clarified by the Nine of Swords in reverse. In some way, you have been feeling a little better mentally because you decided to let go. But Spirit is saying you're letting go either in the wrong way or of the wrong things. Like you might be just repressing shit instead of resolving it, which is a problem. Queen of Cups in reverse, clarified by the Queen of Cups upright. This is saying that you've been up and down when it comes to your mood, your emotions, you might even be taking on other people's emotional burdens. And so this is just really complicating things for you. You're overworking yourself, but you're not realizing it because it's more so conversations instead of actual things. So I know what your title will be. You have the Seven of Wands clarified by the Eight of Cups. So you have been understanding that there's been signs giving to you but it's like you're misinterpreting the signs but for some reason they're saying it's not that you don't know any better like you're just choosing not to know for whatever reason like you were going to do whatever you were going to do so you just are making it fit into your plans no matter what six of pentacles in reverse clarified by the world card as a consequence because this has been going on for quite a while you have some of your ancestors that are just really upset and they're kind of putting you on punishment in the sense that they're not helping you lately. So things are going to get harder until you let go of what you know you need to let go of. And we'll get something specifically from the ancestor deck and then we'll get out of here. Oh my god, I'm dropping a lot of these. You have deep replenishment and warrior woman. So you really do need more rest. Again, you might not realize you're overworking yourself because you're not having a lot of physical movement, but you need mental rest. This doesn't have to be sleep, but maybe just turning your phone off or turning everything off and just coloring or literally sitting in the dark and not doing anything at all. That would actually be really helpful for you. And then you're also being asked if you're doing a good job fulfilling your purpose or not. At this point, you have a pretty good idea, if not super solid, on what your purpose is. So they're asking you why you're not taking more steps towards it. And you don't have to share your answer with anyone, but it is important that you answer that honestly. But that's what I have for you guys. If anything resonated, like, comment, share, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you next week.